Ever wondered what it takes to become rich? Welcome back to Wealth Minds Elite, the place where we redefine success, one elite mind at a time. Today, we're not merely talking about making money. We're diving deeper into the sacrifices, the changes, the shifts in mindset needed to amass real, substantial wealth. The kind of wealth that isn't just about having a hefty bank account, but about achieving financial freedom and success. It's a common myth that wealth is all about earning big paychecks or winning the lottery. But let's debunk that myth right now. Wealth, my friends, is a lifestyle. It's a mindset. It's a journey that requires more than just making money. It demands personal and lifestyle changes that might seem daunting at first. But trust me, once you start walking down this path, you'll realize that these sacrifices are the stepping stones to your financial freedom. So, you might be asking, what are these sacrifices? Well, let's start with the basics. Are you willing to give up certain comforts now for a more prosperous future? Can you let go of immediate pleasures for long-term gains? Are you ready to step out of your comfort zone, to push your boundaries, to challenge yourself? Because believe it or not, that's where the magic happens. That's where you start transforming your dreams into reality. And just a heads up, this journey isn't for the faint-hearted. It's for those who are willing to take risks, those who are ready to embrace change, those who have the courage to step into the unknown. It's for the go-getters, the dreamers, the doers. It's for you, if you're ready to take the plunge. So, are you ready to make these sacrifices? Are you ready to embark on this journey towards wealth? Are you ready to discover what it takes to become truly rich? Stay with me as we unravel the 10 sacrifices you need to make to amass wealth. Firstly, if you want to be rich, you must learn to prioritize your expenses. Now, this doesn't mean you have to live on a shoestring budget or deny yourself all pleasures. It's about understanding what's truly essential to your life and what's not. This is where financial discipline comes into play. It's about making smart decisions that benefit your financial health in the long run. Think about it. That daily cup of gourmet coffee, those impulse buys, that subscription you barely use, they all add up. By cutting out unnecessary spending, you're not just saving money, you're also cultivating a mindset of financial responsibility. And that, my friends, is a key aspect of wealth accumulation. It's about recognizing the difference between needs and wants and choosing to invest in things that contribute to your growth and financial stability. By prioritizing essential expenses, you're putting your money where it matters most, setting the stage for long-term financial success. So, take a good look at your spending habits. Identify where you can make changes. Every step you take towards financial discipline brings you closer to your goal of becoming rich. Remember, a penny saved is a penny earned. Next, consider who you are spending your time with. Our social surroundings profoundly impact our mindset, ambitions, and ultimately, the trajectory of our lives. If you're constantly surrounded by individuals who lack ambition, it's like trying to sprint while you're ankle deep in mud. Imagine, instead, being in an environment where ambition isn't just encouraged, but it's the norm, where big dreams aren't laughed at, but rather, they're expected where every conversation is a potential spark for your next big idea. This is the power of surrounding yourself with ambitious people. These individuals, like you, are on a journey towards success. They understand the struggle, the hustle, and the unwavering determination needed to achieve their goals. Their drive becomes your drive. Their ambition fuels your ambition. Their success stories become your motivation. Remember, birds of a feather flock together if you want to soar like an eagle, you can't be hanging around with the turkeys. So take a good look at your social circle. Are they pushing you towards your goals or pulling you away from them? Who you associate with determines who you become. Third sacrifice on the road to riches is minimizing distractions. Now we all enjoy a good scroll through social media or a binge watch session of our favorite TV show. But when these activities start eating into our productive hours, it's time to hit the brakes. The journey towards wealth isn't a leisurely stroll in the park. It requires focus, determination, and most importantly, effective time management. Consider this. Every hour you spend on distractions is an hour less spent on your path to financial freedom. And let's be honest, that cat video isn't going to help you get there. 
We're not saying you have to cut out all the fun from your life, but just remember to keep your eyes on the prize. Think about it like this. Distractions are like quicksand on your journey to wealth. The more you entertain them, the deeper you sink, and the harder it is to pull yourself out. So, make a conscious effort to minimize these distractions. Dedicate time to your goals and let nothing sway you from your path. Time is money, don't waste it. At number four, sleep is essential, yes, but sometimes you need to trade some Zs for productivity. Now, we're not advocating for sleep deprivation here, folks. We're talking about those times when the call to create, to build, to hustle is so strong, it's worth pushing bedtime a bit further into the night. Those who've achieved great wealth know that the path to prosperity often involves burning the midnight oil. There are ideas to be fleshed out, plans to be made, and dreams to be chased. And let's face it, there are only so many hours in the day. Remember, it's not about punishing yourself with a lack of sleep. It's about recognizing those moments when the potential for progress outweighs the need for rest. Listen to your body, of course, but also listen to your ambition. There's a saying that goes, you can sleep when you're dead. But here's a twist. You can sleep when you're rich. The grind never stops if you're chasing wealth. Next, at number five. Success isn't served on a silver platter. You must take responsibility for it. Picture this. You're a sculptor and your life is the raw block of marble. The masterpiece that emerges depends solely on how you chisel away at it. Your success isn't shaped by external forces, but by your own actions, decisions, and determination. We often find it easy to point fingers at others or to blame circumstances when things don't go our way. It's a defense mechanism a way to shield ourselves from the uncomfortable truth that we might be the ones standing in the way of our own success. But blaming others is like spinning your wheels in the mud. It might feel like you're doing something, but it won't get you anywhere. If you want to build wealth, if you want to join the ranks of the self-made millionaires, you have to stop playing the blame game. Take ownership of your choices. Recognize that you're in the driver's seat of your life. If you're not where you want to be, it's up to you to steer yourself in a different direction. Remember, no one else is going to hand you your dreams. They're not going to carve your masterpiece for you. You have to step up and take the chisel into your own hands. Your success is in your hands, in the sixth spot. Fear of failure is a barrier you must break to become rich. This is an undeniable truth. It's like a wall, towering and intimidating, standing between you and your dreams of wealth. But here's the twist. It's not the failure itself that's the obstacle, it's the fear of it. Imagine you're at a crossroad. One path leads to safety, the known, the predictable. The other path is shrouded in mystery. It's risky, it's unknown. The latter is where the gold is, where the magic happens. It demands courage to step into the unknown, to take that risk. Understand this. Failure is not the opposite of success. It's a part of it. It's the teacher that gives you lessons no school can. It's the sculptor that chisels away at your flaws, shaping you into a better version of yourself. Every millionaire, every successful person you admire, they've all tasted failure, but they didn't let it define them. Instead, they used it as a stepping stone, a learning opportunity. So don't let fear stop you. Embrace the possibility of failure. Dive headfirst into it, for it's through failure that you truly learn. The richest people know this. They've been there. They've failed, they've learned, and they've come out stronger. Don't fear failure, learn from it. That's the mantra of the successful. Make it yours too, coming in at number seven. Wealth isn't built in a day. It requires patience and persistence. It's like planting a seed and waiting for it to grow into a massive tree. The seed of wealth takes time to germinate, sprout, and eventually grow into a towering oak of financial success. You see, the journey to wealth isn't a sprint, it's a marathon. It's not about getting rich quick, but about steadily building your wealth over time. It's about making consistent effort, day in and day out, even when the results aren't immediately visible. It's about staying the course, even when the road gets tough or the progress seems slow. Remember, Rome wasn't built in a day, and neither are fortunes. The world's most successful individuals those whose wealth is measured not just in millions but in billions didn't achieve their financial status overnight. They were patient. They were persistent. They kept pushing, kept striving, kept working. 
even when the odds were stacked against them. So if you're on this journey to wealth, remember to be patient. Understand that it's going to take time. And be persistent. Keep pushing forward, keep making progress, even when it's hard. Because in the end, patience and persistence are key to wealth accumulation. Eighth, belief in oneself is a non-negotiable sacrifice on the path to wealth. It's more than just a saying, it's a fundamental truth. You see, the road to becoming a millionaire, to achieving that level of success, is littered with challenges. And it's your unwavering belief in yourself that will empower you to navigate these challenges, to overcome them and keep moving forward. Think about it. When you doubt yourself, you're essentially putting up roadblocks in your own path. You're hindering your progress, limiting your potential. But when you believe in yourself, when you have faith in your abilities and your vision, you're able to push past these self-imposed limitations. You're able to see the possibilities, not just the obstacles. Belief fuels determination. It fosters resilience. It gives you the courage to take risks, to step out of your comfort zone, to pursue your dreams relentlessly. It's that belief in yourself that will keep you going, even when the going gets tough. And let's be honest, the journey to wealth, to success, it's not always going to be smooth sailing. There will be setbacks, there will be failures. But if you believe in yourself, if you believe in your ability to succeed, you'll be able to pick yourself up, dust yourself off, and keep moving forward. Believe you can, and you're halfway there. It's not just a motivational quote, it's a mantra for success. So believe in yourself, believe in your dreams, and watch as you turn those dreams into reality. Number nine, three, knowledge is power, and in this case, it's the power to become rich. In the quest for wealth, the pursuit of knowledge should never be underestimated. We're not just talking about academic degrees or professional certifications. No, we're talking about the wealth of wisdom that comes from understanding how money works, how to make it work for you, how to manage it, and how to grow it. The most successful people in the world, the ones with the heaviest wallets and the most zeros in their bank accounts, they are perpetual students. They understand that learning never stops. They're always seeking new insights, always looking for new ways to expand their financial knowledge. They read books, attend seminars, listen to podcasts, and engage with financial experts. Why? Because the financial world is dynamic. It's ever evolving. What worked yesterday might not work tomorrow. Staying ahead of the curve, staying informed, it's not just a luxury, it's a necessity. It's a key ingredient in the recipe for financial success. Remember, knowledge isn't static. It's a journey, not a destination. And the more you learn, the more you earn. That's why it's critical to commit to the continuous pursuit of knowledge, particularly financial knowledge, on your path to wealth. Stay informed, stay wealthy. Finally, let's recap the sacrifices you need to make to become rich. It's been a journey of discovery, hasn't it? A journey that enlightens us on the road to financial freedom. A path less traveled, but surely rewarding for those who dare to tread. First, we learned about prioritizing essential expenses. It's not about depriving yourself of life's little pleasures, but about understanding the difference between needs and wants. The secret lies in mastering the art of living within your means while investing wisely for the future. Next, we discovered the power of surrounding ourselves with ambitious people. Remember, you're the average of the five people you spend the most time with. Seek out those who fuel your ambitions and inspire you to reach for the stars. We also talked about minimizing distractions. In a world buzzing with social media notifications and addictive TV shows, it takes discipline to focus on what truly matters. Time is the currency of life. Spend it wisely. Sacrificing sleep for productivity was another sacrifice we delved into. It's not about burning the midnight oil every night, but about making the most of your waking hours. Every hour counts in the pursuit of wealth. Taking responsibility for your success emerged as a vital sacrifice. Wealth is a result of your actions, your decisions. Embrace this responsibility and steer your life towards the success you desire. Overcoming the fear of failure, that's a big one. Failure is not a dead end, but a detour to a better route. Embrace it, learn from it, and march forward with renewed vigor. We emphasize the need to be patient and persistent. Wealth doesn't grow overnight. 
It's a seed that needs time, patience, and nurturing to bloom. Believing in yourself, that's a non-negotiable. Self-belief is the bedrock of success. Nurture it, feed it, let it guide you to your dreams. Finally, we stressed on seeking knowledge. Knowledge is power, especially when it comes to wealth creation. Learn from the experts, read, research, and never stop growing. Remember, the path to wealth is paved with sacrifices. Are you ready to make them?